welcome back at Peter Place. We are playing The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Thanks so much for watching. Thanks so much for liking the videos and subscribing to the channel. Especially for subscribing to the channel. I'm trying to get to... Ooh, I'm on the sky now. I'm trying to get to 750 subscribers as soon as possible. So thanks, uh, thanks for everyone that does subscribe. And I'm also um, thankful for everyone that leaves some nice comments down below. Because that really helps me... Uh, to solve this game even better. I do not have a Korok seed down there yet. That's interesting. So let's go and have a look. In Breath of the Wild, there was a Korok seed at the... Well, let's just travel to the shrine, shall we? That's faster. Uh, and let's see if the Korok seed goes off. Or the Korok seed, the Korok mask goes off. And then I still remember... E, there's a little island there. Ah, oh, wait, no, I did that. That's one of those four. Wow. I should revisit these things more often. Not that I actually use silence princesses, but you know. There, there is no Korok seed alarm? So immediately after going like, wow, Silent Princess is all over. I'm like, oh, no Korok. Mm, apparently not. Apparently there's no Korok seeds on this on this thing. Okay. I can see a chest there, I think. Alright. So first of all, because I don't like you. Pick this up. Yeah. All right, found it. So there was a Korok seed. And guess what? I found it. All right. All right, so Tulan, I am so counting on you to shoot that Irakuda out of the out of the air. You look like you have uh, armor on. Now you don't. Where am I at on this thing? Alright, I'm on the outer rim. Good. Do you have armor on? Or oh I'm out of It looked like you do. <coughs> Alright. 
So apparently a uh, Talus uh, thing will do the trick just as nicely. Cool. That's actually a pretty nifty idea, right? To give the enemies some sort of like um armor. Alright, so there was only one Korok here, it would appear. The only other possibility I see for a Korok would be the actual building over there. shot three arrows huh? can I get that one I can oh I heard that I heard that Alright, that was... wow. Um... I just got my, my, you know, what handed to me by Elizalfos with a bow. This ruin also had a Korok seed, so let's go and quickly check that out. I never managed to get the Korok seeds here in Breath of, Ooh, Breath of the Wild. I don't think I've ever been here in Tears of the Kingdom. Oh. Ah, there's a Hinox here now. Okay. <laughs> Does have shin guards. All right, so let's let's actually try and do this. All right, so do I have any impressive? Ooh, this is cool. Where's he at? Alright, so let's try and do that again. No, no, no. Wow, no. Tulin, thank you so very much. these things I can actually take. 
All right. Uh, before I forget. Where? Somewhere up there, maybe? Found it, found it, found it. Yeah. So basically in any kind of reality you would have burned this Oroxide alive right now. almost ricocheted in your face you know <laughs> okay um that would have been bad so there was a coroxide here and i found it so let's briefly go check out uh that building over there obviously i think it will have enemies so let's also get another weapon in because um Wow. Two, three arrows, okay. Okay, there's one of these wizard things flying around. Other than that, I'm not really feeling the Korok love. Seriously. Aww. Sword. No, thank you. No, there was a raft here, and that's about it. No, no co-op seats. All right, all right. Uh, the ruby sword. I'm not really interested in that either. Uh, what I might be interested in, though, is uh, going back. No, oh, wrong button. To this sky island. Uh, and the easiest way to get there would be from this tower, I guess. And the reason I want to go there is not to fight the King Glee. Well, do I want to fight the King Gleok? I am not equipped to fight the King Gleok right now, I think. Uh, let me check the amount of rocket shields I have. Alright, so no rocket shield, so the only thing that I will go do there is take a picture.
I don't believe for a second. I was just gonna say, um, that's not what that uh, used to look like. I don't believe for a second that there's a Korok seed there. But you never know. And the other thing that I'm interested in to know is like, how about the treasure? There was a treasure there, but I beat that King Gliok already once, or once already. English, it's difficult. Um, is the treasure there again? Has it also respawned, or can you only because the treasure was a sage's will? And the difficulty with this King Gliok was that it was already flying around there. It was not just peacefully sitting around, it was flying. There you go, King Gliok. I'm running out of stamina. Not good. On the map. Wrong button. Uh, how far am I? I'm... do like immediately if I'm high up enough because I want to go and check if that treasure is there can you ride a Gliok because I'm above it now but the treasure does not appear to be there right Treasure is not there, so can we get a picture in from a king? Leader? All right, so mission accomplished. We snuck in behind the king Leok. So let's, um, we know the treasure isn't there, so there's no point in fighting this again to we'll unlock yet another treasure. So let's quickly go back here, out of harm's way, and show our good friend Kilton, I think it's Kilton, what a King Gliok looks like, right? have it all right i was thinking that 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 arc right there is prime location actually i'm also pretty interested let's do that first because he's there now let's fast travel there and let's go see what we can do because i've never been there once I've met him, Colton, I think his name is, I gave him some, but maybe there's stuff that I can buy from his shop that I don't have yet. He should be here somewhere, right? Uh, let me briefly get my bearings. So this is where the tower's at. There's monsters there. 
Where is Starry Town from here? Ah, there is he. Okay. No longer interested where Starry Town is because I found what I actually was looking for. Let's maybe make a little detour. Ooh, that's interesting to know. I'm always interested in those kind of... Wait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm interested in that kind of horn. I need that. That's wonderful fusing material. Um... You can send 73, I've got 28. Alright. So... Nothing special about that. He tells me how many bubble frogs I still need. Whoa, uh, that was a mistake. All right, so let's let's circle back, and then somewhere in that valley, there they are. All right, all right. They're doing quite the big laps, huh? Ideally, what I would do, obviously, is have them attack each other. You know. Master Sword is back in play. Right in time, my trusted swords. So um, I think, uh, what's her name, Minoru is doing a wonderful job. While I'm foraging for parts. I don't think that was me. This was me. Yeah, oh, it's, it's, it's virtually gone. No. Yeah. That was cool, though. There was a lamb there. So, again, can't take this. Ooh, but I can't take that. Alright. So, I have another one of those horns. Sweet. 
what is this? Oh, it's just vegetation. All right. So actually, all of this, and I only lost half a heart. Interesting. All of this was an interesting sidestep from going back to Tarrytown and showing the King Gleok picture. Tarrytown being over... Over where? Wow! Where is Tarrytown from here? Oh, it's over there. Hmm. Dreaming, my sweet monsters. I do not have any super interesting fuse parts, so for me, you can go on about your business. No problemo. Wow. <laughs> Too low. Alright, so there we go. So the only reason I attacked them is because I thought I would score a lot of fire fruits or whatever it was that they were uh, foraging. Because I was wrong. <laughs> so back on my way to Terry. Where is the, the land bridge to Terry Town? Oh, it's over there. That's cinematic. Oh, do it. There you go. Uh, what? Who did that? Do not touch the wolves. I will take the meat now that you did, but don't touch the wolves. Anyway. Ooh, shock fruits. I had no idea they were around here. So sometimes it does have some benefit to take the long way around instead of fast traveling all over the place. And there we are, early morning. So are you going to attack the fox too? Is that what you're gonna do? Is that what you're gonna do? No. I'm outrunning a fox. Am I? Yes, if I could keep running. I'm No, I'm on par with it. I'm scaring it into Tarrytown. Poor beast. And then it just disappears. Smart move. Smart move. Come on, that, that is from so far away. How can you make out any detail from that? Ooh. Nice detail. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Borrow it. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna just stack that on top of the other monsters. Let's see what happens. falling what is it supported by uh. 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 I, 
is that? How is that not falling? Look! Look! That, that is very interesting. All right. Oh. Does it take it? <laughs> it does. It does look like it's floating. Eyeballs in the village. That remains good. So for once it's in frame. Oh. So what will I get now? Because I have the monster saddle and the monster bridle, so... Diamond, that is nice. <laughs> he must, he must want a line, all right, at some point. Hmm. Oh no, we're done. We are done. He does not need a line, all right. All right. So given that we are over the half an hour mark, I think we're also done with this uh, episode. Uh, so there is a nice collection of monsters there, if I say so myself. Uh, what's with the tunnel though? Well, there's, there's nothing in the tunnel. Uh, so we will end the episode uh, right here as well. So, thanks so much for watching, thanks so much for liking the videos and subscribing to the channel. And then I will catch you in the next one. Goodbye!